And then I loved this one. However strong the opponent is, when I stand to face them, the power to overcome them, power that I myself don't understand comes forth. It's so critical. And this thing I'm trying to point out here that when the energy starts to hit, what we're really trying to develop is a spirit of positive listening, not whatever that, that, other, that other stuff is. You know, not fighting, not whining, not, you know, feeling sorry for yourself, not blaming anybody, just the energies here, process the, eat the energy, as Bob would say, and I would say, and, and listen, assimilate the intelligence of it. This is doing something to you. And I was talking about um, this concept of listening, and someone said, well, don't you mean like being heard or something, or really hearing them or something? And I said, no. There were a lot of things that my parents said, and I heard them. I just didn't listen. You know, that there's something going on here when you're in that other mode, uh, as opposed to when you actually can hear what somebody says. And here's what I really want to say. Not only do I think it's the only way one of us smaller, weaker people might ever have a chance in a fight, uh, is being able to move in a body relationship that neutralizes their power, never, never opposing it. But that, that much more important to me, the change in how it is when every situation, I need to talk to you, and you're okay, as opposed to what do you, what, <laughs> you know, and, well, but it's, it is natural, it's programmed in for four billion years of reactivity, you know, it's like it's so much a part of us, but um, the little exercise you do learning to ride a bike, you feel left, you feel right, da, da, da. and when your bike tips to the right, you turn to the right. You don't stop and say to yourself, oh my God, it's tipping to the right. You're way past that. But in the beginning, that's almost what you had to do. And that's what you have to do now, is to unify and at a slow speed until it gets to the point where all of a sudden you can play a song. And then it's something else. It's, it's something else entirely. And again, I don't get in fights, but I have conversations with people all the time. And you know, most of my relationships are pretty good. I thank Bob and Osensei and the Aikikami for that. I don't see that you're mastering it yet, but you've got the basics of, there's a sense of flow, and if you listen to it, and don't lose your integrity, you're still standing on the flow, when you move in harmony with it, something very natural and beautiful starts to unfold. And like I say, forget the fights, I'm talking about the magic of your life unfolding and your bestowed mission, which probably is not in the ring. It is a weird one because your mind has to let go of the control for this experiential part to merge with it and become a unified field of much greater intelligence.